Am I gonna like this? Not if I do my job right. Remember when I was so desperate to get over Pablo? I begged you to leech him out of me. Well, I don't remember using those words exactly. Yeah, but you but... agreed and you stood by me. Wasn't exactly a success. I'm over him now. And like finding Manolo markdowns at a shoe sale, I'm much better <laughs> at it than you. So, are you gonna put yourself in my very capable hands? What have I got to lose? Your addiction to Kendall. The key <sighs> is to build up your resistance. Mm -hmm. Increase your immunity so even a full frontal Kendall assault will leave you bored. Now, I'm gonna be Kendall and you're gonna be you. And we're back at the Chandler Library, like you were tonight, and you were standing here. Kendall was standing here. What did you talk about? Well, Kendall did most of the talking. Figures. What did she say? Well, I don't remember, like, exactly. Come on, Rye. You want to you wanna change this? You got to give till it hurts. Okay, okay. She said something about us, about me and her not being over, that I will always want her. Okay, I'll take it from there. Ryan, you're my heart. You're my soul. I ache for you. The memory of your touch leaves me full of desire. Don't deny it. You want me. Say it. You want me. I want you. Ah, oh, ow. Oh, what was that for? Negative conditioning. You're supposed to be resisting me. But I didn't... Ryan, it's just you and me. We're alone. I've wanted to do this for such a long time. Long time. Open them. You're supposed to resist me. I thought you wanted to get over Kendall. I did. I do. Well, it's never going to happen if you let her kiss you every time she gets the urge to merge. Now, we're going to keep doing this until you're free of Kendall's lip block, okay? Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. 